Hello guys and welcome to Jarelina Super Nursery. Here I am with my handsome boy, Jaden. And Jaden is the Everett, Everett sculpt by Don Donofrio. And he was beautifully painted by Lisa and Mrs. Me. And I have uh, something cute that I want to put on him. And this is a three months size astronaut um, shirt. Let me see if you can see in pants. Oh, I love it. And he looks so nice on shorts. But on the other hand, he has a uh, overall uh, with the onesie and like a rocket there. So both are nice, but I think I'm going with the pants um, because as I told you, he looks so nice on pants and shorts. So I'm going to use that on him. Let me look for the scissors to cut this because so many tickets and things. And I was loving him in this onesie because of the colors. Um, I really love the colors. And there's another one that I have there that I want to put on them. But I think more on Kellen than on him. Because I don't like him with without sleeves. I like him more with longer sleeves to the elbow or long. He looks very nice on that. And he looks very nice on shorts. So we're going to change him. And you will see I don't change my baby's diapers often. Um, I do believe you, you, don't, you don't see that um, after you dress them. So, so yeah. Um, so this is a outfit that I bought at Costco because I go every Monday and sometimes they, hi they have these cute outfits and I grab them. Sometimes they have more like, um, things that I use for my real kids, but that I don't like with my, my dolls. Uh, for example, they have this, um, long pants with onesies under you know you know the onesie with the pants uh i don't like that i do like that for for i don't know from time to time but i don't like to dress my babies like that and this diaper is like saying goodbye but i think it can hold a little bit more okay i have a little interruption there um so I'm going to put the sandals because I don't know, I want to put sandals on my babies and they don't want to cooperate with me. Uh, this is a three month size and he fits very well. He's a big baby, he's, he's not, I'm sorry again, but um, yeah, he's a big baby and look, he looks amazing on, on shorts. And this looks a little bit big on him, sadly, but it's nice because I don't have to worry about being too too tight or anything. But look, he looks amazing. I love pants on him. He looks amazing on shorts. Um, this is stretch, but I have to put it on here. I have to fix his hair because um he was folded and his hair lace when you know i put a satin this thing when i fold them i use the satin that was from my first his previous mommy was my um uh, dear friend uh, uh sherry uh over reese nursery and uh, he she sent him with that and when He's laying, I use the satin cloth for satin, yeah, satin cloth. And that way I feel easy going with him because they are rooted. And mostly because I don't want the, the hair to be messing up. You see guys, he looks very cute. And he needs to, to have his hair fixed, of course. Um, but he 
he he's a very cute baby he's very nice to dress the same as journey because he's zero to three and that's why i love so much that size i'm trying to be very careful um there's this tiny feet entering here and he's uh wide enough to enter so and just for the pictures because i don't want them i don't let them with sandals because i don't know i just feel like the same with something black i don't let let them with that particular outfit too long i just take pictures i love to take pictures of my babies i'm struggling a little bit but it's just because i don't want to to rub them Okay. Okay. So he's now ready. So we need two fixes here. I'm going to show you how I do it because with curly hair, um, can be a little bit more tricky, but it's not. It's actually not tricky. It's not difficult. It's just a matter of practice and knowledge about how to do things but i don't find i don't know where i put the brush okay i found it i was brushing journey's hair for the pictures um but it's very easy to fix every baby's hair when it's curly when it's curly what i do is i usually don't spray it on them but I use little sambu, but you can use a little bit of water, especially cold water. You don't want to, to put any heat or anything. And you just turn your brush like that. When the hair is wet, you will see that it, it like very easily. Let me wet it a little bit. I comb it with this brush and then i do this like a little wave with the same brush and that way he can have and depending on the way um the hair was rooted and all that the waves are a little bit more pronounced and sometimes they are a little bit more like locked or can be more loose but that's a matter of the hair and and all that but that's the way you do curls it's not nothing complicated just to wet it and do this and i have another interruption give me one sec okay again guys with the little class you wet the hair i comb it and then I do the curls see it curls because this is curly hair there you have mr. Jaden and I don't want to come his hair in the back because he's going to be laying again um, sometimes I do come everything on the head and then after that um, I let him do you know to to um the hair to dry you see you do this and you will have a curl there and you can do it in different um ways or different uh oh my goodness directions but yeah I love his hair so so much. I wish I can root the same hair to to Kellen because this is just a, a very very nice hair. It's very soft and it's very cool. I really love the hair. So now he has his hair brushed and his eyebrows and he's all ready to take pictures on him. 
So if you have a baby with curly hair, you don't know what to do with him or her. Um, it's not easy. It's not uh, something complicated. Just wet the hair, and the more wet it is, the easier it goes to to just do the curls. And I hope you can see because the lighting is not the best, but maybe there you can see a little bit better. Let me see there. When I put my hand, I'm looking at the screen and maybe you cannot see everything that I'm trying to show, but hopefully you can get an idea of um, how to do the curls on babies with curly hair. Because in the, the pictures of the artist, you will see they look amazing with those, those curls when they travel to you, they lose the curls. And it's not complicated, guys. You need to take your time to wet the hair and brush, doing this motion, turning this, and grabbing the hair and turning it. And you will see the curls. So um, I hope this was helpful. I need to sit down, guys. I really do want to sit down and make a video, chatting with you making a topic video but i have been super busy and i love to be super busy of course i feel active i feel productive and all that but at the same time i cannot be spending a lot of time with my hobby which is very sad <laughs> but um hopefully very soon i i can have a time to sit down and chat with you guys but i have that clothing sitting there just waiting for the right time for for me to make a video with them because i really want to share my babies but at the same time i don't have the the time that i want you know i can make a video very quick video and two pictures and go but i do like to spend time with them i really enjoy making videos i really enjoy changing them and i really enjoy chatting with you guys and reading your comments after you see the video and just that that exchange of of you know a dolly thing because i don't have that in my surroundings i i am the crazy woman with the <laughs> with the uh, dolls with the dolls that looks like creepy because they look realistic and those things you know so i don't have many people that i can talk to about my hobby in in my area but i do i am very open to, um with my friends um if i meet something someone new i start talking about what i love about reborning i start sharing pictures and i show my babies and if they visit me if you're going to be my friend you're going to love me or hate me but i'm going to be open about it because i really like it and I do think that uh, even if you disagree with me in whatever that you think you can disagree because of my hobby or my preferences and all that, but I think respect is very important and at least that that's only the only thing that I want. I don't want you to love my dolls. I don't want you to go out of your comfort zone if you're not a doll collector because you have to love at least or babies or dolls. But if you love dolls, you're going to like it. And if you do hate dolls since you were little or whatever, you're going to hate the hobby. But I do just want or I just ask to be respectful with it. And you don't have to agree. I just share who I am and you have the option to accept me or don't accept me or just live with whatever that I like. So um, I just love to make videos because I feel that with you guys, I can be myself. I can um say all that i want about dolls and you guys understand my language because you're doll collectors you love this form of art and maybe if you're new you're watching for the first time and you see these realistic dolls that look so real some people say looks like a dead baby but i don't see that i see a sleeping baby so it's a matter of perspective but if you're new and you're watching this for the first time and you don't understand what is it this is an art doll, very expensive, handmade art doll. Handmade, sculpted, hand um, made board, 
and hand painted so everything is just handmade with these babies so they have little imperfections here and there but they are look so realistic and i love that the realistic they look the more that i like um but yeah um i love to make videos that's that was my point i love to make videos i love to change my babies and i combined those two things and i just feel so happy to do it so um when i'm telling you that i want to have the time to sit down it's not because i feel pressured to do it because i i have to cover something in my channel i don't have to um at this moment my channel is not monetized i do want to monetize my channel but um uh, i need to work on all the things that youtube are asking me uh, to have to monetize my channel um but i do it because i really love to change my babies and share them with you guys that you guys understand my language <laughs> um i have very good friends that are collectors some of them are art artists and collectors and some are just artists and some are just collectors so i have my group of, group of friends that i can share dolls and all that i'm just telling in person i don't have anybody to just share my dolls that actually love what i do but um yeah, I hope you like this video, guys. And if you do so, please give me a thumbs up. And if you're new to this channel, go back and watch my other videos. And if you like the content, please consider subscribing to it. See you until the next video, guys. Bye-bye. You know just what you do, you do to me. Play my emotions like a pair of puppet strings. Did it ever occur to you, my heart's more than a toy? Please go easy on me, babe. Send message after message, forward my call. Next day you hit me back like nothing happened at all. What about all the things you used to say to me? This ain't the way it's supposed to be, and you know. I wouldn't do that to you, you know, I wouldn't treat you that way.